Sparrow Racing. Now, I, like so many other people, was originally skeptical when this was announced a few days ago, but I've taken the time to play it today, and honestly, I really enjoy it. It seems like the Destiny developers took advantage of the very floaty, sliding on ice feel that the Sparrows have, and designed tracks and a racing mechanic that really benefits those who understand and can work with this odd, floaty, almost always kind of drifting control scheme. Now the courses are designed to where you have to make a decision between hitting the speed gates and running as fast as you can through the level, or occasionally skipping a speed gate or taking an alternate path to try to not waste time. It's sort of a give and take. Is it better to slow down and take this turn tight, or do you want to just speed through and hope you don't hit a wall? And It can create some pretty intense situations, especially if several people are fighting over a particular set of gates, usually at the beginning of a race. Everyone will be fighting over those first sets of gates, and it can get pretty rough. Not to mention the enemies on the track, which will be firing at you, and can put a real quick end to your run out in the lead. Indeed, there's a lot of rubber banding going on here, and that isn't too bad. What that means is a person could be out in the lead, and due to messing up, quickly be knocked back to last place, or alternately, someone in last place could get quite a few correct turns and good hits on speed gates, and move out in the lead, so even if you're in last place, you still have a good chance to maneuver to the front, and if you're in first place with a far lead, just a few mistakes could easily put you in last place, so you've still got to keep on your toes. That all being said, it creates a much more intense racing experience than you would expect. Uh, the sense of speed is there, it's pretty strong, especially if you've got the better uh, sparrows, and all in all, you're just sitting there constantly wondering, am I going to make this gate, is this the right turn, and trying to figure out just when to do everything you need to do to stay out in front. Or if you're behind, trying to figure out how to claw your way a few extra seconds, and maybe hoping that the player ahead messes up once or twice. It happens, more often than you think. Now of course the one problem with Sparrow Racing I'd have to say would be how the Sparrows control. Now I like how they control, that slippery feel they have, but it seems like a lot of players don't have an understanding of it, so the occasional Sparrow Race you might see a couple of players who are trailing far behind everyone else, and it can feel a little unfair at times, but then again when you're in PvP, if you're someone like me, most of the time other players are dominating you, I just, I'm not skilled at that kind of stuff, so I guess this sort of levels out the playing field for those of us who like to be competitive with other players but don't want to be in hardcore combat. Now like any element of Destiny, there's plenty of racing related rewards you'll receive for competing in the Sparrow races. From new horns for your Sparrow, to racing outfits for your character, to even unlocking new, faster, more capable Sparrows, there's quite a bit of new things to earn here. Now what I'm hoping is that this becomes a recurring element to the game. I'm certainly not thinking they're going to go through the effort of developing a racing engine and mechanics for that for just a one-time use, but I'm hoping this is a little more often than other events, and I really think it should become a standard thing just like the Crucible is. There's so many PvP elements and modes that I don't play on. This is the one that I actually really enjoy and have fun with. That being said, it's not for everybody. If the Sparrow controls really aren't your thing and you have trouble getting from point A to point B in the game, you probably won't enjoy the racing, but if you're like me and find the Sparrows really fun to just cruise along on, then this is right up your alley. Thanks for watching. Catch everyone next time.